good afternoon. Uh, as regards uh, today's uh, Eurogroup, there are several uh, important uh, items on agenda. I would start with uh, European uh, semester, where we'll discuss Euro area recommendations. On the fiscal, it's basically uh, on member states to continue with uh, differentiated uh, fiscal uh, policy, meaning those member states which have fiscal space can invest more, first and foremost, in investment, and those which are still in excessive uh, deficit or uh, uh, still uh, need to uh, continue their adjustment path towards medium-term budgetary objectives should, con should continue to do so. Uh, we also emphasize the need uh, to strengthen the banking union, working in parallel both on risk reduction and uh, risk sharing side, and uh, accelerate intensify our work on capital markets uh, union. We are also uh, going to discuss uh, today uh, the Greek uh, program uh, to take stock on the ongoing uh, situation. And it must be uh, said that the economic situation in Greece is gradually improving. So uh, it's uh, expected that also last year's uh, uh, economy performed slightly better than our previous uh, forecasts. And Greece has substantially outperformed on uh, last year's uh, fiscal targets, is going to meet uh, uh, this year's target. And uh, we need to finalize the work on uh, outstanding measures on 2018. But I would say that this is certainly within reach. Uh, of course, it requires effort from both sides to finalize a second review. Uh, well, uh, this is uh, going to be uh, part of those uh, negotiations. In any case, uh, we see that Greece is on a, a track to meet its uh, primary surplus target of 3.5% of uh, GDP uh, next year in 2018, and uh, we'll have uh, further discussions on what is the exact fiscal trajectory after 2018. Uh, and uh, what uh, potential uh, measures or contingency mechanisms there might be uh, needed also to ensure uh, IMF participation in the program. Would we have to wait until the next uh, Eurogroup on February 20? Uh, for the conclusion of the second week review? Well, as you know, from the European Commission side, we are uh, putting substance in front of uh, deadlines. So now it's a good occasion to take uh, stock. Uh, also, uh, I hope to accelerate the work. But at the end of the day, it's uh, what uh, depends is fulfillment of the pro program uh, conditionality. Well, uh, from our side, we are working in a spirit uh, which uh, uh, expects also continued IMF involvement uh, in the program. And this is something which IMF also uh, acknowledged in the May last uh, uh, year. So we, uh, we are working also uh, uh, to uh, see what necessary measures are to uh, ensure full IMF participation. Do you think that Theresa May driving to the US to pre-negotiate some kind of trade agreement with Donald Trump is complicating the preparation of Brexit negotiations? Well, uh, this certainly is not going to be uh, part of our uh, discussions today in uh, Eurogroup. As you know, on this, our position is uh, very clear that we will start negotiations or uh, commenting also UK positions once uh, formal Article 50 uh, notification will be given by the UK. Thank you. continue their adjustment path towards medium-term budgetary objectives should, should continue to